Hey everyone, it's Allison here. Um, <clears throat> I have a few wallets to show you. For Rainelia Live, Renee, maybe? I don't know. Here's your wallet. It's just a big word wallet and it's clear taped over now. Um, my friend bought this one, so this one's not for sale anymore. Um, but, oh, and then Cheeky Dog Lover bought the Cookie Monster and it's over there. It's right. Eh. Yeah, there. Yeah. So these are the two I have left. They're $5 with free shipping. Um, now that I have red, I'm going to redo Grover, so I'll post a video of that when it's done. But I really, really love Oscar. It looks so cute. So yeah, this is what they look like. Um, this wallet is for sale because I'm making the person who got this one for free, I'm making them a different one because I like guested. Whoa, that's like not even a word. I guessed on <laughs> what they might want. It turns out they're a girl. So this isn't going to work, so I'm going to remake their wallet. Fold evenly both sides, two pockets, they all fit cards, and zip, uh, Velcro coin pouch with an ID crate plastic. There's a video on this if you want to see more specs about it. For She's Crafty, here is your complete order. I've already sewn the Sonic wallet, which has oops, three pockets, ID's falling out, three pockets, hidden, hidden, ID and then a pocket up top. Full fold is clear. Next up your woman's wallet. It's just plain zebra. And since there's a lot of pink, instead of using pink at the bottom, I used chrome, so I hope you like that. And then it opens here and here. Also, for some reason I forgot to tape this down. Like there's tape on this side, but there's not on this side. And I don't know what I did. So if you want me to tape that down, then I can. But there might be like a little line right here. So just let me know. Um, I'll show you that pockets fit. I'm not going to put them down all the way because it kind of just takes up a lot of time. But here's what they look like when they're all the way down. They go up about that far, each one. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six. Oops, <laughs> lost it. And then seven. And... When it's up the top, it doesn't show over. So, oh, and then the ID. Looks like, oh, you push it in all the way. Looks like that. And then you have the cool pocket, which I like these for. It, like, carts fit really nicely in them. I mean, I wouldn't hold it upside down and shake it, but as you can see, it kind of doesn't fall. But it's still really nice if you have, like, a credit card you might have or something that you want you use frequently or receipts. I really love these pockets. And then you have your Ziploc coin pouch. Also a tip on making women's wallets thinner, even though they're really thin. Just do like one strip right there and the rest is clear and like you can't even tell. Also how to do no fold over lines. Throw a piece of tape over it. I'll show you with this. Let's see if I can. Alright, here we go. This is what it looked like before. Then I threw some tape over it long as the wallet. And I did that for the entire span. It's just basic. It's extremely basic. Um, so yes, stop asking. <laughs> no, that was me. You can ask me anything. I don't care. I like talking to people. Um, what was I going to do? Oh yeah. This one is for um, Cheeky Dog Lover. You got... Um, or you have, I should use proper grammar. I'm tired of grammar though. Okay, so there's an X pocket here, cards fit, folds evenly. Um, it goes in this way, um, it goes down at the bottom, you can see where I cut a little notch. Same with this one, there's notches cut so they fit in nicely, but they won't fall out through the back. Oops, I messed the X. Same with this one, it's nice. Flip it up, you got your ID, goes in this way. And then three pockets, one folds, two, and three. Um, since these are each one strip each because it's like a half inch, like sometimes it gets caught, but it pushes down pretty easily. So it's not that big of a deal. Then on this side, you have a really cool coin pouch. Like that. And then there's a really cool design on the inside. It's like little squares and rectangles and stuff. 
So then on this side, you have again three pockets. One up top folds, closes, like always. Can you see this? There we go. Two and three. This one slides in really easily. Then on this side here, you have um, a coin pouch. Cards go in the side right here. And then Velcro here. Also, if you want one of these with your wallets, it's an extra $2 because then I'll put in a hidden pocket and then I'll throw in one of these. But it's just an extra $2 while I have my um, wallet deal going on. But when it's back to $10, it'll only be like a dollar. So, yeah, well, it depends. I'm not sure on prices yet. So, yeah, I think that's everything. Oh, did I show this to Renee something? Um, here's your wallet. I clear taped it over and everything. Also, I can't remember if I said this, so if I did, just like exit out and like stop watching the video. But um, these are the only ones I have left for sale. They're each $5 with no shipping. I'm going to redo um, Grover's Mouth. This one I really like. So yeah, these are the only two I have left. I got red tape, so I'll be making Elmo soon. So if you would like to pre-order Elmo, let me know. Um, there's a random piece of tape on Grover. What in the world is that? Look at that. <laughs> okay, well, I'm going to fix that. So yeah, that's it. Hope you like it. And bye. Tap a vid.